Shalom. Welcome to our ministry. I thank God for this opportunity to share His Word with you. I pray the mercy and grace of God to overflow your life in the mighty name of His Holy Son, Jesus Christ. Lift up your heads, O ye gates, and be ye lifted up, ye everlasting doors, and the King of glory shall come in. Who is this King of glory? The Lord strong and mighty, the Lord mighty in battle. Lift up your heads, O ye gates, even lift them up, ye everlasting doors, and the King of glory shall come in. Who is this King of glory? The Lord of hosts. He is the King of glory. Selah. Psalm 24, 7 through 10. This video is a call to action for prayer warriors and watchmen, the body of Christ, the ecclesia, the church, especially the ministries in the United States of America. In 2018, in the month of May, God spoke to Donald. In a strong, clear voice, he gave him an urgent message about our country. He directed Donald to pray over the capital of our nation, Washington, D.C., and over all of the state capitals in our nation. He told Donald that the enemy had erected strongholds over our government, over the executive, legislative, and judicial branches, federal and state, and over every capital in our nation. We ask you, the Ecclesia, the Body of Christ, those of you who live in Washington, D.C., or in the 50 states, to stand in agreement with these prayers, as there is power in agreement, as promised in Matthew eighteen nineteen to 20 and join us in praying over your respective states. Please share these videos for the glory of God with other believers in your respective states, and pray as well over all of the states of our great nation. We're starting with Washington, D.C. in this series, as that is the seat of power in this country. Thank you. Thou shalt also decree a thing, and it shall be established unto thee, and the light shall shine upon thy ways. Job twenty-two, twenty-eight. Again, I say unto you, that if two of you shall agree on earth as touching anything that they shall ask, it shall be done for them of my Father, which is in heaven. For where two or three are gathered together in my name, there am I in the midst of them. Matthew eighteen, nineteen, twenty. The hills melted like wax at the presence of the Lord, at the presence of the Lord of the whole earth. Psalm 97, 5. For I, saith the Lord, will be unto her a wall of fire round about, and will be the glory in the midst of her. Zechariah 2, 5. Abba, Father, as I and everyone within the sound of my voice come before you in prayer, we seek first your kingdom and your righteousness, and all of these things are added unto us. We apply upon Washington, D.C., and upon the 50 states, the precious blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth that destroys the devil in his works. Heavenly Father, we apply the precious blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth upon the nation's capital, Washington, D.C., upon the 50 states and the capitals of the 50 states, upon the nation's capital building, upon the capital buildings of the 50 states, upon the White House, the Supreme Court, the buildings, and every public servant in them. We apply the precious blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth upon the regions of Washington, D.C., and every region in the 50 states, upon the city of and every neighborhood in Washington, D.C., and upon the counties, cities, and neighborhoods in the 50 states, upon every ministry and business in Washington, D.C., and in the 50 states, upon every home in Washington, D.C., and in the 50 states. We surrender into your care everything in Washington, D.C., and in the 50 states that we just put under the blood of Jesus Christ. Abba, Father, we have full faith 
that you are now bringing all of these things under your control. Everything under the precious blood of Jesus Christ is now brought into the obedience of the one true Messiah, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We give the Holy Spirit unrestricted access to everything in Washington, D.C. and in the 50 states that we just placed under the blood of Jesus Christ. We ask the Holy Spirit, please work in everything under the blood as you please. Holy Spirit, please cause all of Satan's strongholds, territorial strongholds, territorial powers and principalities to be pulled down and demolished and cause all strongmen, devils, demons, evil, wicked, and unclean spirits that are rooted in anything we placed under the precious blood of Jesus Christ to be immediately arrested and paralyzed, bound, rebuked, and cast out with all of their works, never to return in Jesus' mighty name. Abba Father, please immediately fill those voids where these came out with your unquenchable revival fire. To God be all the glory. Hallelujah. In Jesus' mighty name, we declare the decree that right now the devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of Washington, D.C. The devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of the 50 states. O Elohim Yahweh, release the fire of your presence in and around Washington, D.C. and the 50 states, according to the promises of your word of truth in Psalm 97.5 and Zechariah 2.5, which immediately forms a permanent, impenetrable wall of divine fire round about Washington, D.C. and the 50 states. You are the glory in the midst of Washington, D.C. and the 50 states. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name, I pray. In Jesus' mighty name, I declare the decree, the devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of the nation's capital, Washington, D.C. The devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of the capitals of the 50 states. O Elohim Yahweh, release the fire of your presence in and around the nation's capital, Washington, D.C., and the capitals of the 50 states, according to the promises of your word of truth in Psalm 97, 5 and Zechariah 2, 5, which immediately forms a permanent, impenetrable wall of divine fire round about the nation's capital, Washington, D.C., and the capitals of the 50 states, you are the glory in the midst of the nation's capital, Washington, D.C., and the capitals of the 50 states. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name I pray. In Jesus' mighty name I declare the decree, the devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of the Capitol building in Washington, D.C. The devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of the Capitol buildings of the 50 states. O Elohim Yahweh, release the fire of your presence in and around the Capitol building of Washington, D.C. and the Capitol buildings of the 50 states, according to the promises of your word of truth in Psalm 97, 5 and Zechariah 2, 5, which immediately forms a permanent, impenetrable wall of divine fire round about the Capitol building in Washington, D.C. and the Capitol buildings of the 50 states. You are the glory in the midst of the Capitol building in Washington, D.C., and the capital buildings of the 50 states. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name, I pray. In Jesus' mighty name, I declare the decree. The devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of the White House and every public servant in Washington, D.C. O Elohim Yahweh, release the fire of your presence in and around the White House and every public servant in Washington, D.C., according to the promises of your word of truth in Psalm 97, 5 and Zechariah 2, 5, which immediately forms a permanent impenetrable wall of divine fire round about the White House and every public servant in Washington, D.C. You are the glory in the midst of the White House and every public servant in Washington, D.C. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name I pray. In Jesus' mighty name, I declare the decree, the devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of 
the Supreme Court building, and every public servant in Washington, D.C., the devil and his works, are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of the state's Supreme Court buildings, and every public servant of the 50 states. O Elohim Yahweh, release the fire of your presence in and around the Supreme Court building, and every public servant in Washington, D.C., and the state Supreme Court buildings and every public servant of the 50 states, according to the promises of your word of truth in Psalm 97, 5 and Zechariah 2, 5, which immediately forms a permanent impenetrable wall of divine fire round about the Supreme Court building and every public servant in Washington, D.C. and the state Supreme Court buildings and every public servant of the 50 states. And you are the glory in the midst of the Supreme Court building and every public servant in Washington, D.C., and the state Supreme Court buildings, and every public servant of the 50 states. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name I pray. In Jesus' mighty name I declare the decree, the devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of the region and city of Washington, D.C. The devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of every region, county, and city in the 50 states. O Elohim Yahweh, release the fire of your presence in and around the region and city of Washington, D.C., and every region, county, and city in the 50 states, according to the promises of your word of truth in Psalm 97, 5, and Zechariah 2, 5, which immediately forms a permanent, impenetrable wall of divine fire round about the region and city of Washington, D.C., and every region and city in the 50 states. You are the glory in the midst of the region and city of Washington, D.C., and every region, county, and city in the 50 states. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name I pray. In Jesus' mighty name, we declare the decree, the devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of every neighborhood in Washington, D.C. The devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of every neighborhood in the 50 states. O Elohim Yahweh, release the fire of your presence in and around every neighborhood in Washington, D.C. and every neighborhood in the 50 states, according to the promises of your word of truth in Psalm 97.5, and Zechariah 2, 5, which immediately forms a permanent, impenetrable wall of divine fire round about every neighborhood in Washington, D.C., and every neighborhood in the 50 states. You are the glory in the midst of every neighborhood in Washington, D.C., and every neighborhood in the 50 states. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name I pray. In Jesus' mighty name, I declare the decree, the devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of every ministry and business in Washington, D.C. The devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of every ministry and business in the 50 states. O Elohim Yahweh, release the fire of your presence in and around every ministry and business in Washington, D.C. and every ministry and business in the 50 states, according to the promises of your word of truth in Psalm 97, 5 and Zechariah 2, 5, which immediately forms a permanent impenetrable wall of divine fire round about every ministry and business in Washington, D.C. and every ministry and business in the 50 states. You are the glory in the midst of every ministry and business in Washington, D.C., and every ministry and business in the 50 states. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name I pray. In Jesus' name, we declare the decree. The devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of every home in Washington, D.C. The devil and his works are immediately and permanently destroyed from off of and out of every home in the 50 states. O Elohim Yahweh, release the fire of your presence in and around every home in Washington, D.C., and every home in the 50 states, according to the promises of your word of truth in Psalm 97, 5, and Zechariah 2, 5, which immediately forms a permanent, impenetrable wall of divine fire round about every home in Washington, D.C., and every home in the 50 states. You are the glory in the midst of every home in Washington, D.C., and in every home in the 50 states. Hallelujah. 
In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name I pray. But seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you. Matthew six thirty three. Thou shalt also decree a thing, and it shall be established unto thee, and the light shall shine upon thy ways. Job twenty two twenty eight. Wherefore God hath also highly exalted him, and given him a name which is above every name. Philippians two nine. The Lord hath prepared his throne in the heavens, and his kingdom ruleth over all. Bless the Lord, ye his angels, that excel in strength, that do his commandments, hearkening unto the voice of his word. Bless ye the Lord, all his hosts, ye ministers of his, that do his pleasure. Bless the Lord, all of his works, in all places of his dominion. Bless the Lord, O my soul. Psalm 103, 19 to 22. He that committeth sin is of the devil, for the devil sinneth from the beginning. For this purpose the Son of God was manifest, that he might destroy the works of the devil. 1 John 3, 8. Immediately he received his sight and followed Jesus, praising God. When all the people saw it, they also praised God. Luke 18.43 And all things whatsoever ye shall ask in prayer, believing, ye shall receive. Matthew 21.22 For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, and the government shall be upon his shoulder, and his name shall be called Wonderful, Counselor, the Mighty God, the Everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace, Isaiah 9, 6. The hills melted like wax at the presence of the Lord, at the presence of the Lord of the whole earth, Psalm 97, 5. For I, saith the Lord, will be unto her a wall of fire round about, and will be the glory in the midst of her, Zechariah 2, 5. Then he answered and spake unto me, saying, This is the word of the Lord unto Zerubbabel, saying, Not by might, nor by power, but by my spirit, saith the Lord of hosts. Zechariah 4, 6. And Jesus, looking upon them, saith, With men it is impossible, but not with God, for with God all things are possible. Mark ten twenty seven. Hallelujah. It is done. Thank you, Abba Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit.